This is the five chemical reactions of amines in the discussed model. One is alkylation of amines, second one acylation, third one benzoylation called Scotton-Bowman reaction, fourth one carbyl amine, very very important reaction, carbyl amine reaction and the fifth one is very important one have the reaction with benzene sulfonyl chloride called what? Hinsberg reagent. Next property of amines, you know, reaction with reaction of amines with nitrous acid with nitrous acid HNO2 nitrous acid right yes nitric acid HNO3 nitrous acid is HNO2 it is an air it is used as an in situ and you know it is an unstable whenever we, whenever we need we could prepare immediately ok again by the action of Sodium nitrite and NCL NaNO2 Sodium nitrite and HCl will get C HNO2 plus NaCl okay now so how again nitrous acid is an unstable Okay, this is the last in C2. Okay. Next one now, you know. Different amines react with the nitrous acid in different ways to produce the different products. The LR amines are put up. One day with the nitrous acid just react like the same product put up. So, how are you? First one, one day. First one, one day. So, are the primary aliphatic amines? Primary, primary aliphatic amines. Primary aliphatic amines reacts with nitrous acid. General explanation is that primary aliphatic amine reacts with nitrous acid. With the formation of alcohol, it liberates nitrogen gas. In the liberate water, nitrogen gas. How can a general reaction be killed? Or NH2. How can a this is say primary aliphatic amine reacts with HNO2. How can a अथवा ही बर्बंदी ना लो HNO2 ना नोट रही हो HNO2 इस बात की बात में इतना साफ से ये क्या ना बताएं ये NH2 ग्रुप इस रिप्लेस बाय हाइड्रोक्सिल ग्रुप विल गेट ROH ये मतलब हम गेट अल्कोहल प्लस H2O वाटर इन एक और दिन है एन टू राइट वन एग्जांपल अब राम ग्रुप पर चेंज मारे सारे सी टू वी एच पर अब तो सी एच तरीन आता तो बड़े ऐसा नमाइ अब तो ई थाई लमाइ Ethanamai, Atwa Ethylamai. Ethylamai reacts with the nitrous acid. Yes, what is the R group? C2H5. We'll get the respecting alcohol. Now the door. Ethyl alcohol. Atwa Ethanol. With the liberation of nitrogen gas. With the liberation of nitrogen gas. 
Okay, now that's why right. this reaction is used as a test for primary aliphatic amine. Sorry, the reaction of primary aliphatic amine is the test I use what the very compound I distinguish model primary amine to the hackathon. No other amines evolves nitrogen when it reacts with nitrous acid. Primary aliphatic amine between very young they are my thorn rate by this. Primary aromatic in both secondary aliphatic aromatic in both tertiary aliphatic aromatic in both very young they are my thorn row as a nitrogen gas will liberate water. Yavaga when it reacts with nitrous acid. That's why this reaction is used as a test for primary aliphatic amine. Got it? Next one. When primary aromatic amine, one example, got the result. C6H5NH2. Phenyl amine. At the benzene amine. At the amine. This is primary aromatic amine. And then the Yes, when primary aromatic amine reacts with okay now that will be the nitrous acid in presence of HCl in an ice cold condition like 0 to 5 degrees Celsius. When a primary aromatic amine like anilin reacts with the nitrous acid in presence of HCl in an ice cold condition like 0 to 5 degrees Celsius, now we buy products in octide H2, next pillar molecule of H2, total is tied to 2 moles of H2O. In order to radical level combined body, we put up the node. We'll get C6H5 N N will be N2 remain with the CL. Yes, this is called BDC and red benzene diazonium chloride. Benzene diazonium chloride. Okay, so when a primary aromatic amine like aniline reacts with the nitrous acid in presence of HCl at 0 to 5 degrees Celsius gives a salt, diazonium salt. What is the name of the salt? Benzene diazonium chloride. And this reaction is known as, I put it in phenol and you know, diazotization. The reaction is going to be Diazotization and the cream. Cut it. So this is the reaction of primary aliphatic and primary aromatic combined with nitrous acid. Next one there. Secondary aliphatic both both aliphatic and aromatic. Secondary amine Both aliphatic and aromatic secondary amines reacts with nitrous acid gives a yellow oily liquid of N nitroso compound N nitroso amines it is a yellow oily liquid. Alright. Now, the aliphatic and the aromatic and the Both aliphatic and aromatic secondary amines reacts with the nitrous acid. gives N nitroso amines. That is N nitroso compounds. It is a yellow oily liquid. How can I do the example? Let us consider a secondary aliphatic amine, say C2H5 twice NH. What is the name of this secondary? Not NH is the function group of secondary amine. Secondary 
alkyl aliphatic amine so what is its name diethyl carbonate you know diethyl amine i know case in ethyl ethanamine how can it it reacts with it reacts with yeah nitrous acid H and O2 secondary aliphatic amine reacts with the nitrous acid. What is a byproduct? Not a byproduct, right? So we we'll get C2H5 twice. N N O. What is a byproduct? Water. Is it not? Not really. The resulting compound is nitrogen. Here, we have to say NO. What is the NO group coordination compound? That is the nitrosyl lanthane. Okay, now. So, nitrosyl group. It is attached to the nitrogen. How do you locate NO? N. So, N nitrosyl. N nitrosyl. Okay. So, N and I are my. N nitroso N N diethyl amine. Okay, na. Ate wala aromatic amine ko na. Secondary aromatic amine. Say C six H five N H C H three. Hey, brother, what is the common name of this secondary aromatic amine? Nitrogen. Here it is. Chagi da. N methyl amine. Okay, na. I P S C. Common name methyl aniline. How to name? N methyl aniline. Yes, it reacts with nitrous acid. Yes, the byproduct will be water. So we'll get. We will get what? C six H five N C H three N O. How can it? And the N nitroso. In order to do N B I I B B. Right. But doing exam here, the board exam here. Only primary aliphatic and primary aromatic amine reacts with nitrous acid. But for competitive exams, any competitive exams, you must also know that. So reaction of you know both secondary and even tertiary amines with nitrous acid. Okay, now next video we will talk about secondary aliphatic and aromatic amine. Act. In the tertiary third way, how does? Tertiary amine reacts with nitrous acid. Tertiary amines reacts with nitrous acid. Okay. Hardly. Yes, tertiary aromatic and tertiary aromatic amines reacts with nitrous acid in different ways. What are the higher input? Okay, now. Tertiary. Aliphatic amine, tertiary aliphatic amine reacts with nitrous acid to give a salt. Okay, it gives a salt called trialkyl ammonium nitrite. The double, the double salt part is unwarming. The salt and water decomposes to give N nitroso compound. N nitroso amine bath plus alcohol. In the general expression, how does tertiary aliphatic amine react with nitrous acid? 
When touch really arithmetic combined reacts with the right resource, first it gives a salt which on warming decomposes to give your nitroso compound and alcohol. Okay, now. So, one example. One example for that. Say C2H5 trilis N. What is the name of this salt? Triethyl amide, commonly. Triethyl amide. Okay, now. And it's a UPSC name. A no, N, comma, N, triethyl ethanamide. That's what I'm going to do today. Yes, when it reacts with the nitrous acid. First, we need to think that you're a salt. And when the nitrogen atom is a lone pair of electrons in it. How do you know? All lone pair of electrons are going to make money when the proton abstract modified. So, we'll get C2H5. Trials. NH. Due to the loss of lone pair of electron, it develops positive charge. Okay. Nitrogen atom develops the positive charge and the nitrate ion develops negative charge. Okay. This is the salt and its name is HD ethyl group in a blue. Triethyl. What about this? Nitrogen atom containing positive charge. Ammonium. Nitrate. Triethyl. Triethyl ammonium nitrate. Okay. This salt and warming. Rates are in part of just to make it part of the salt. And warming. It gives C2H5 flies. N and O. Okay, now. C2H5 plus plus ethanol. Okay. C2H5 plus N and O plus alcohol. Yeah, what can you do with the ethyl group? Ethanol. And like N nitroso compound. What is what is its name? N nitroso. In the in the example, what is it? N comma N diethyl amide. Okay, then secondary sorry tertiary aliphatic amide reacts with the nitrous acid. It gives what? Yeah, first it gives a salt. A salt again what they do? Alkyting. It decomposes to give. It gives. Come on. It gives. Come on. It gives. It gives a nitroso compound and alcohol. Whereas tertiary aromatic amide, tertiary aromatic amide, tertiary aromatic amide, when it reacts with the nitrous acid, it gives. Para nitroso compound. Okay, now it will tell you it gives the para nitroso amide. And for para nitroso compound, how do we get to know? It is a green solid. A green solid, but to the red, that's understood. It results what? Para nitroso compound. Okay, one example to another. CH3 twice N C6H3 Is it a tertiary amide? Yes, I can return to the presence of N NH in red secondary NH2 in red primary So is it an aromatic tertiary amide? How? N is in the tertiary Benzene regular in the aromatic What is its name? So diethyl Sorry, dimethyl anilin अथवा यं कामा यं दही में थाई आने यं कामा यं दही में थाई आने 
when it reacts with the nitrous acid HNO2 or HONO at para position only. Okay, yaw carbon atom of the benzene ring gali, one the substrate, one the group attached on it. That is opposite position only. Okay, now. A position at the gali, para, at para position at hydrogen is replaced by nitrous of group. Hydrogen byproduct in the water will get CH3 twice N. C6, H5, H4. I can ignore the hydrogen on the para function. I can again substitute that by the nitrosol group. Right? So this is called para nitrosol. Para nitrosol dimethyladenine. At one end then. So this is the reaction of amines with nitrous acid. Otherly, in the board exam, just you have reaction of only primary aliphatic and aromatic amines with nitrous acid. Whereas secondary and tertiary aliphatic and aromatic amines of nitrous acid Aromatic amides with nitrous acid is only for your complicated exams. Got it? Atta hai tenre.